Time now for our Life and Info segment where we focus on information useful for your everyday life. Today we're going to talk about a new consumption trend here in South Korea where people are opening up their wallets more just for some extra peace of mind. For that, I'm happy to say we have our Kim Dami in the studio with us uh, who's promised not to sneeze during this <laughs> segment. Uh, Dami, so what's this new trend all about and what prompted it? So people prioritize their peace of mind. So uh, meaning people are willing to and intend to spend their money on products, perhaps even those that are more expensive, that are proven safe, especially in this era of distrust among consumption, um, production and manufacturing. Yeah, that makes sense. There have been a number of cases in Korea. I remember one in, in relation to mattresses, that mm. there were some concerns. They might have some uh, limited amount of radioactive material right. in them. There's also been some scandals over sanitary pads uh, for women that made uh, some women rather ill. And uh, also, um, yes, the uh, powdered milk formula mm. for babies. That was a big thing a, a couple of years ago. Right. So ever since people found out their everyday products that they use themselves and even with their family can be harmful and even toxic, uh, consumers are now making more careful and c conscious spending decisions, especially when it comes to our uh, daily source of energy, food, like one of Korean's most beloved dishes, fried chicken. A local chicken franchise only fries 58 portions of chicken with the same batch of oil to ensure customers that their chickens are cooked with clean, fresh oil. And after the, cooking the 58th portion of chicken, the old oil is replaced. And Dami, um, when you talk about that, we must mention that there have been some cases in Korea where that's made the news that chicken places have been recycling their oil over and over again. Unfortunately. And it, and it just doesn't taste the same. No, it tastes no. awful. It doesn't. It, it doesn't look the same either. Right. So under the uh, chicken order system, your chicken is served with a sticker that indicates when your chicken was cooked. Along with a delicious food, the sticker seems to mean more than just a number to customers. I've heard some chicken places only replace their oil once every three or four days. But just knowing they use new oil after every 58 portions gives us peace of mind, especially when we're eating it. So there's no specific safety reason why 58 is such an important number. It's just a, a way of them showing that they change the oil regularly so the customers have the peace of mind that we're talking about. Right. right. So uh, it is interesting that people are making these conscious consumer mm. decisions these days, even on uh, products that cost 10 to 15 dollars like a piece of fried chicken. Exactly. And it's not just food. Uh, people have become even more conscious of potential problems. So uh, consumers are especially careful when it comes to shopping for what they need for one third of their life mattresses. So as soon as the radon emitting mattresses scandal occurred in South Korea last year, uh, safety concerns and complaints related to mattresses rocketed over 700 percent compared to the previous year. So responding to the deep concerns and mistrust among consumers, a betting company has publicized its mattress lab where people can actually see and experience how their beds are built. So something that you don't normally get to witness. Factory tours are already all booked until August. That's how much people are interested in seeing the products in real life, especially how they are developed and in what type of environment they're manufactured. So we all are aware of how misleading advertisements can be, but uh, people can learn about products and see with their own eyes that what they're going to purchase is safe and good to go. I'm a newlywed looking for a new bed for a new home because I can see how my bed is produced. I can tell that it's safe. Mattresses are quite expensive, but I've decided to invest in one after the tour today. From food to what you sleep on, people have become more conscious and careful when it comes to shopping. But what I've introduced as a consumption trend, trend warns industries, including marketing and manufacturing, that it's their job to be transparent and instill a trust in consumers. Yeah, it's good to see that consumers are the ones driving 
uh, this uh, focus on safety because there are still some aspects to do uh, with manufacturing in South Korea that could do with the more stringent safety regulations uh, and whatnot. So it's good to see, and transparency is always a good thing. Of course, <laughs> transparency and safety. Yes, and uh, be careful when you go online as well because I mm. think there's lots of fake products. Uh, knocking around there, you think you're getting a good price, but if it's going to make you ill or cause some other problem, then it's really not going to be worth it, is right. it? Right. Okay, Dami, thank you very much for your report, and uh, we very much look forward to seeing you again next time. Anytime. Thanks for having me.